Hey guys, this is Smokey Cat. I'm going to show you today how to start up another account. So, first thing you need to do is make sure that you have your account connected to Facebook. And you can see here under the gear icon that we are connected to Facebook. Now, what I'm going to do is just going to go to my desktop and hold down on my Empires and Allies icon and I'm going to delete it and I'll just say keep on that version hit my home button again go to my app store search for empires and allies there we go and I'm going to download it again and it's going to load again okay so now that it is downloaded we can go ahead and click open but it's time to start up a new account so we're gonna go through the process of starting a new account by going through the motions again Do is upgrade since we have 14 gold. We'll go ahead and upgrade and we'll collect gold and do some achievements. Now I can choose my name. I'm going to choose a new name and my new name will be Smoky Cat. Done. There we are. My new account is created. Now I can build that up from the lowly ones that it is, HQ level 2, and on we go. And what I want to show is that now that you've created this new second account, you can go to your gear icon, connect to Facebook, and then now you can switch between your other accounts in this one. And here's my original Smoky Cat account. And you can see my other account was the current one. And so here's my level 43 account. And I can go back to my other accounts under Switch, which is down here below all my other ones called Smoky Cat 2. Now, for some reason, it creates these two accounts shows 12 and 13 not sure why but it's still the same one as, as I collect select the, either one it will sh sh highlight both of those so I can go back to it and open up this uh, account back to where it, what it was now an important thing that you need to do here now that you have a second account is to friend your other accounts so I have most of my other accounts at a, an alliance. And yes, we're going to search for an alliance to be a part of. But right now, my, most of my friends are here. And you can see Smoky Cat. I'm going to go ahead and hit friend. And that will send an in, uh, invite there. And here underneath the wreath icon, I have an incoming invite from Smoky Cat to accept. Click the list button, and I want to find that other Smoky Cat too. Now I could sort of scroll up through here and try to find him. Uh, keep on scrolling up because I have lots of friends, and there he is, Smoky Cat too. And I can go ahead and gift some resources to help him build. So I can give 25% of my supplies. Oh, it's too high. For, or he's too low to receive any resources yet. But once he gets up to like an HQ5, he'll be able to receive fuel and supplies and steel. So I'm just going to close out of there. But I just wanted to show you a, a, a quick way to be able to find your friends fast. Let's say that their, their name is at the bottom of the list without having to scroll up here I can just click A and Z again 
and there he is at the bottom of the uh, alphabet. But being able to click the AZ back and forth, go from the A, A through Z, and now from Z to A. Or you can search by uh, metals, which I know he's way down there. So great little resources to be able to click on the friends list and being able to find your uh, friends and people that you want to gift much easier. Here we are at Smoky Cat and I want to I'm going to be doing some attacks but I don't know or I can't remember sometimes what my levels are and so like if I go to say a quick match and my quick match and I'm gonna go and try to attack this eight level 18 uh, it's, he's got an artillery 12 and I'm not sure if my a10 or my hellfire will be able to take care of that so what do I do well I've created notes on my iPhone and iPad which I can sort of pop out of the uh, system real quick click on notes and you can do this on your on a piece of paper or you can do it in, in notes which I find it easy to update and here we are on their ENA levels and I can uh, let me get rid of this I can scroll through all my accounts and sort of easily see what I can take out with my Hellfire, my A10, uh, what kind of uh, levels I got from all my accounts. And so when I'm on Wraith Kitten, I can use this as a reference to uh, see what kind of levels I have. And soon I'll be creating a new account for my new Smoky Cat 2 uh, account. So I'll be able to see what it, it can use when it, it's attacking, whether it's attacking with the Alliance Wars or a just by itself in a quick match or in the world missions. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe and to like. Have a great day.